the end of World War II, the Soviets had declared war on Japan. Brian Grabinski, uh, I teach social studies and phys ed. I coach baseball, I have in the past. I've coached football in a couple years, uh, coaching girls tennis. I'm trying to become as viral as Aiden Lynch. I've been here for 23 years. This is year 23 at the high school for me. That's gonna bring us you know, along with the Truman Doctrine. It's gonna bring us into the Korean War that we'll talk about today. It's gonna bring us into Vietnam. Before student teaching e even ended, uh, I had uh, I'd offered a, been offered a position here at Hamilton and have been here ever since. Initially, you know, Stalin cuts off all ground access to West Berlin. When I got the job, I didn't necessarily think I would be here for a long time. After my first or second year, I applied for a job back at my old high school, and that was where I'd always pictured myself ending up. That's where my dad had coached and, and taught, and, and that was where I wanted to be. And I went through a first round interview and I realized it just, it, it didn't feel right. And I withdrew my name from consideration for that job. And I realized at that point, you know, I'd had the opportunity to potentially leave. I would have had been offered the job, but I had that opportunity. And I realized in that moment that this is where I want to be. And from that time on, I've, I've never even looked at or considered anything else. You know, after the war, we're trying to influence people to be like us. The Soviets are trying to influence people to be like them. Can't beat the, the, the kids that we have and the families that they come from. You know, I, a lot of times I tell our, our baseball parents as we talk about, you know, our focuses and what we try to really focus on. I tell them, I'm not naive. I, I, we're not introducing these, you know, these concepts of hard work and teamwork and self-sacrifice and stuff to them. We're just hoping to reinforce those lessons that are already being learned at home. And, and we have a community that really emphasizes those things and, and makes it a great place to, to live and to raise a family, which you know, I've got three kids now, two in the high school, one in the middle school, and just the overall uh, values of the community uh, make it a great place to work and live.